All right, who's ready for another road trip vlog? Here we go. Next stop is a volcano. Good morning. No, 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 no. No, 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 come on. Go backwards. Okay, we have to pick you up, I suppose. Yes, we're doing that. She wants to go so bad. Yeah. Look, she's like, I'm sitting down. You cannot get me. The joke's on you, sis. We got you. We are all packed up for our road trip. We are going up to the volcano today. So we are up nice and early. All of our stuff is packed into Anna's tiny car. I don't know how we did it, but we're going. So we've arrived at the volcano park. I don't know if you can see up the front, but there's a volcano up there. Okay, so we are at the volcano National Park. The volcano is right there. It's kind of covered in fog, so you can't see it that much, but there it is. We have this lovely little viewing spot. So we're here, and they label the volcano. We can't, we can't go any closer. Yeah, it's very dangerous. It's so this is as close as we're allowed to get because it's active. You can only get um, closer if you are a volcanologist. I am. I am a volcanologist, oh, so really? that's really weird that we're not getting closer. So Sarah was just saying that she read that it's really rare to see the top of the volcano because it's so cloudy. All right, yes, please narrate the video with some volcano facts. Okay. It was dormant for a long, long time. Uh-huh. And then in the 60s, it exploded. And now it's also like the youngest of the Costa Rican volcanoes. Uh -huh. And when scientists, I don't know how they did, but when scientists are able to measure the activity of the volcano, uh -huh. they figured that this one has been active for 7,000 years. Oh my God. And that's one of the youngest. It's happening, we're hiking. <laughs> I would like everyone to know that us, the three of us, who never hiking do anything exists. physical, are hiking. Anna, how tall is the volcano? It's like 5,000 miles. Miles? Miles. And how high up, how high up are we? Just a few feet on, few feet on the back. <laughs> this is what we're looking at. This is our hiking view. My parents are gonna say, this isn't a hike, you're walking on flat ground. Ah uh, yes, here's our reward. Old lava. I would like my mom to tell me this is not a real hike. This is a real hike. Look, you can do the top. Here she is. We have a lake over here, volcano over there. And for anyone who tells me this is not a hike, this is definitely a hike. We hiked on these rocks. Did you there a ghost or a really cool sounding bird in these trees? I see its butt. <laughs> Oh my god, there it is. Oh my god, I see it too. I see it too. Oh my god, we're bird watchers. This is a bird watching vlog. We decided that hiking is just continuously saying we're almost there until it's true. We are leaving the volcano to go to our chocolate rainforest tour. Even though we just went to the rainforest, we're going again. <laughs> there she is. Looking beautiful. I can't believe we can see the very top. No. It's stunning. Have you ever seen the actual plant of vanilla? No. Well, now you have. But wow. you can't say that you know the plant until you touch it. So, so I can't get a photo of it. Okay, I'm touching it. You believe that to learn about we something, you have to see it with your hands. Oh my god, it's so Which of course doesn't apply to job works or things. <laughs> so is this the oh, wow. one we cut nope. and use? Is it is this is one? This? Actually, let me tell you how it works. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, vanilla Wait, can be a real havoc uh, to make oh, because we get it exactly. Yes, that's so right. So this, this is the harvested yeah, part? That's the one. Well, let me tell you how it grows into the vanilla. The flower itself only blooms in a period of about one month, once a year, where we can get up to 15 flowers, each blooming in different days. Ow. Only for a morning, by the way. Early in the morning, the flower is in full bloom. By afternoon, already close and falling down if it's not pollinated. It has to be pollinated within the first few hours in the morning. If you don't, no vanilla at all. Uh, this is done by hand because the pollinator only takes some areas of Mexico. So you have to go one by one with a little stick that takes yeah. a lot of work. When it's properly pollinated, uh, the flower won't fall. That's when we know that it works. It will start to dry out. And the stem is what becomes the vanilla bean. Whoa. It takes nine months for that to be ready to harvest. Wow. When we harvest it, we still have to ferment it, it, it cure it, and dry it. That takes usually about six months. Let's do this presentation properly. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce to you the amazing cacao. Wow. wow. It's wow. stunning. You gotta give some love Woo! to that. One taste is good. It's gorgeous. Let's touch it. Oh, wow. It feels it's heavy. It's heavy. It feels like a rock. Little flowers. These are gonna become the cacaos. 
and they're gonna make chocolate. You're gonna mm. grow up to be chocolate. Look at how many this tree has. That's a lot. I can't believe how like hard they are. Like they're like rocks. Yeah. They are rocks. It's an absolute unit. It looks oh. gross. Wanna taste it? No. I think that I say yes. <laughs> Just suck on the pulp like a candy. I'm scared. And then you throw it behind you into the plantation. Oh, okay. Just suck on it. Nice. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, thanks. Oh, both of them are for me. I know, I know. It kind of looks like a booger, but the flip is really nice. <laughs> Try it, eat it. <laughs> it's good, right? Why not? That's not that bad. It is fruity. It's like a. It's a fruit. But you can touch it. Actually, if you spread it around like this, you help us spread it in the box. Wow, I'm helping. I'm helping. Something else I want to do is to take a seed and break it open. Look at the color that we got inside. And the aroma, and if you're feeling it great, open. you can give it taste a little piece of the seed inside. How do you break it open? Just your hands. Thanks. There you go. I can taste it, he said. Should we taste it? Or no? If you like, it's going to be eater. Belly rubbing some of the flavor. Wow. Did you just like lick it? Yeah, just take a little piece and eat it. Right. I'm gonna break mine. Okay, this one open. Who wants it? You got it? Wow. Yeah. It does taste chocolatey. It does taste chocolatey. Yeah. First is bitter, second is bitter, but then you get... It's yeah, it's definitely it's chocolatey. Inside. Now, the most common question that uh, I have in this part is, well, how you dry anything in Costa Rica? True. Good question. Good question, yeah. It is a good question. But right. these greenhouses what help us. And you can feel the effects. Yeah. It's built in a way to conserve the heat inside and keep the rain and the humidity outside. Wow. So, yeah, it was the best quality that we can have thing. in there. Wow. So please take two two seeds from there and break it open. Just don't get burned because they are hot. Oh. They are hot. Just like destroy it? Yeah. Just you kill them. You kill the anger. Destroy your enemies. This is my enemies. So oh, I would like to destroy my enemies, Here. please. Destroy my enemies. <laughs> oh, wow. She's going at her enemies. Yes, bye. <laughs> It's right. therapeutic. You want to try it? <laughs> Your enemies, Sarah. But that's the shell yeah, as well as the inside. That's oh. everything, right? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. That is. Wow. Uh, well, folks, uh, I'm afraid that we'll need your help in this one. You know, a lot of people ask me why don't we use uh, electric yeah, yeah. grinders. We don't need it. We need customers. <laughs> yes. All right, you come now. <laughs> Take yeah, your payment. Get your payment. Yes. Your payment, please. Thank you. <laughs> This it's hard at first. Yeah. It is hard. I'll yeah, take my payment now. <laughs> <laughs> We've had hot water to that paste and grind, mix it using again what? high technology. Wow. You can add as much sugar as you need from over here. Why is it small? Also, if you want to experiment a little bit, we got a whole little Starbucks in here. Of this. Yeah, yeah. I was going to that we will need that spoon later. We got a surprise for you after this, and no spoon, no surprise. Okay. Okay. What do you think? I definitely need some sugar. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, I got it. I'll eat that. Do you have your spoon with you? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you what we're gonna do. Jenny will fill it with chocolate, and you can eat it like that. Or you can come over here. With all that, whatever you like, from all the spices from before, and also a few new things that we got, like coconut, almonds, peanuts. Marshmallows, raisins, coffee beans, sprinkles, nibs of cacao, and sea salt. Wow. Wow. I'm ready. Oh, I'm so excited. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. We're just eating straight up spoonfuls of chocolate. Can I have some sea salt, please? That's what I'm getting. Wow, thank you. I'd also like salt. It's really hot. It's very hot. Yeah, be careful. <laughs> the salt is really, really good. Yeah. Okay, we're just we're trying different combinations of chocolate now. This one is hibiscus, salt, and vanilla. He made it special for us. I'm ready. That's so good. Yeah. That's so good. Yeah. That's amazing. I'm scared. What's it called? The volcano. The volcano. It has ginger, black pepper, and cayenne pepper. Do it. She just went right in for it too. It's a one bite. You yeah, it's really good actually. Is it spicy? A little, but like only in the end. So we just got out of the chocolate tour and it was absolutely amazing. And we are somehow full, even though all we had was four spoonfuls of chocolate. I'm not really clear how that works. And like a quarter cup of, of hot little chocolate. hot chocolate. That's literally all we've had and like our breakfast, which was a cheese tortilla. So like we are, I don't know how this is happening. Now we're going to our hotel. We're gonna go in the hot springs and I'm so excited. 
Okay, so we just got here to our hotel and I'm shook because they just came up and gave us towels and these beverages. I never felt more rich than I do right this moment. The towel is scented. I just need to, I just need to comment on that. Restaurant that is in the house coming for lunch. Well, before I'm Here we are. Let me open the door. Okay. Okay. Wow. Bienvenidos. Gracias. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, I didn't realize we were going to like the nicest hotel in the entire country. This is absolutely amazing. Look at our view. We have a volcano view. Can you believe? Well, I cannot Can believe it. Believe? Okay, okay, this is the reaction. We are completely shook at how nice this place is. We were like, like holding our breath the guy was the like guy leaving. to shut the door so like, we could like actually Okay, what is happening? First of all, look at our freaking view. Our it's volcano our view. Our volcano view, okay? She's right there. She's, She's right there. there. <laughs> this is where people see when they said this is my view at my hotel. This I is insane. Never. And then here's our lovely beds right here. We walk in and there's the TV is playing. The, peop the TV is playing with beautiful food we can eat. The only weird part is that you can peep on people in the shower. That's really weird. That is so weird. That's really odd. That's Look, awesome. they gave us three robes. I don't even know what to say. Absolutely. Look at how beautiful this is. Oh my god. I'm gonna take like six showers in here in one night. Yeah, I agree. Oh my god. Look at this. There's a sewing kit. Oh Whoa. my god. That's so Luxury. You know that you're in a rich hotel when wow, I'm I'm completely obsessed. This is the nicest hotel I've ever seen. It's very cute how they gave us three of everything. Like they gave us three cups, yeah. they gave us three robes. I'm obsessed. This is the best day of my life. Even though I said yesterday was the best day of my life because I saw sloths. If you're wondering if we're watching Survivor while we're in our own Survivor themed land, the answer would be absolutely. Absolutamente. We're getting ready to go to dinner and then we're going to the hot springs and we're just waiting here for our driver because that's a thing here. If you don't want to walk anywhere, you literally just call a golf cart. We're playing, we're paying so much money for this. Like of course we're gonna use our free golf cart service. Mm -hmm. Here we are at our pleasant little dinner table. This is the pool right there. This is our view. Here's the restaurant. There's a little meat station. There's a ceviche station over there. There's desserts in this little case. Here's some pastas. There's a white sauce. What's this? There's a green like fish thing. It's tilapia. I literally want everything except that. We're ready to eat. We all have so much. Everything looks so good. Wow, it's done. Let's see what they just brought out. So literally nobody told them that it was Anna's birthday and they just brought out this beautiful little dessert. Look at that. I'm so touched. It's stunning. I have no idea how they found out it's my birthday. Okay, so we're all done with dinner and we are going to the hot springs, which are right over here. You can't really see it, but here's the hot spring and it's raining, so it's gonna feel amazing. Mickey to Mickey. Wow. We're back. Oh, it's freezing. We're back from the hot springs. It was amazing. We stayed there for like two hours. And now we're gonna get ready for bed and kind of chill. Maybe order some at room service. But we got back and I was just about to put my robe on and they left us little pairs of slippers. That's so nice. I love being rich. Oh my God, we're literally so rich. <laughs> okay, so we're all bundled in our robes here and we just did a really fun video called Coast, uh, no called Americans Try Costa Rican Snacks. That's gonna be a fun little separate video. These are all of our snacks that we tried. They were all great. I will not spoil you until you are favorite. <laughs> so you'll have to just watch the video to see that. But I think that's all for today. We had a lovely day um, here at Tabacon and up 
by the volcano. It was so much fun. And tomorrow we are off for more fun in the rainforest. So, cheers. That's all. Okay, bye. Cheers. Bye. bye.